I'm Emily Coleman. I'm 27 years old. Um, I am married. I have a beautiful daughter and a wonderful husband. And I'm originally from Wisconsin, but I now live in Ohio. Um, I was born with a rare birth defect called bladder extrophy. And I think that um, it's made me a lot of who I am today and definitely has changed my life for the better. And I really enjoy spending time with my family and the Green Bay Packers. I had a series of surgeries my first couple days of birth. I was at Milwaukee Children's for about eight weeks after I was born, um, which is two hours away from my parents' house. So for my parents, it was very hard um, going back and forth and taking time with my two older sisters, um, making sure everybody had enough time. And when, after I was born, um, I didn't have another surgery until I was about four at Johns Hopkins in Baltimore, Maryland. Um, Dr. Robert Jeffs, with the assisting of Dr. Stephen DeSimo, um, did my bladder neck reconstruction there at the age of four, um, and my osteotomy, which um, actually was very successful in making me continent, and um, is a lot of the reason why I have had such a great life. So also when I was at Johns Hopkins, um, my, I was getting my BNR done and bladder neck reconstruction and my osteotomy. My doctor, uh, Dr. Robert Jeffs and Dr. Stephen DeSimo, they introduced me to another little boy who had bladder extrophy. Um, we were both there with our moms, um, both four years old. He was from Ohio, I was from Wisconsin, and they thought it would be a good idea for us to meet for moral support and just companionship and have someone to be there for each other. And, um, so I was introduced to him, and we hit it off right away. We were great friends. We spent eight weeks together um, at the Ronald McDonald House recovering from the same exact, same exact surgery. Um, Cameron had um, his bladder neck reconstruction and osteotomy done at the same time. So we became quick friends, and we were confined to wagons the whole time, that we, for the majority of the time that we were there recovering from the surgery. So we, with our moms, would go around the Inner Harbor in Baltimore in our wagons and they would just pull us around everywhere and we were great friends and we stayed in contact for a very long time.